good morning and uh, welcome to the session. Um, we are basically going to understand the MLOps concepts, uh, which is the most trending uh, topic, I should say, in the industry right now. And uh, obviously, it becomes very, very important for whatever the work that the team is doing is actually consumed by the end users. And unfortunately, data scientists who are not a programmers, they're not software developers, right? So they do not know how to <clears throat> ensure that the machine learning models that they are developing are given uh, to the end users. I mean, the consumption is, is something that software development team should take care of. But again, um, if the software development team has to work on deploying or integrating the solution that is developed, which is machine learning models, the software development team should also understand what application that they are deploying, how the application is developed, what are the right, finer aspects of the development, the life cycle of this entire product development. Because when they are integrating, they also need to ensure that there is continuous integration and continuous development. This is the one primary key aspect that we need to look at when we are talking about productionizing any solution. So software developers are, are going to focus on this aspect. And for that, software developers should, uh, developers should know what does machine learning is all about. So <clears throat> there are two different teams, you can say, two different entities or two different worlds. And without understanding how these two worlds work, we will not be able to effectively productionize the solution. So this is where the elimination of both these capabilities are coming together. We are talking about machine learning and we are talking about operationalizing the solution. So we are bringing this together and we are basically calling this as MLOps. So MLOps engineers are expected to understand data science and machine learning concepts the machine learning development life cycle and various aspects of the development of machine learning model. Plus, they need to also understand the capabilities of how a solution can be operationalized. And when we talk about operationalizing, this is the gray area for majority of the data scientists or data analysts, people who work with data, this is the gray area for this. We will not be learning everything under development aspects, but the most important things that we need to consider for deploying is something that we are going to cover. And here, when we talk about operationalizing, we always need to look at two different things. This is a software that we need to ensure that the end users can start using it, right? So this is a software piece of code. This piece of code has to be integrated in an environment with where already some of the applications are running. So this is like your hardware, assume. These are your computers, right? Servers, basically. And on the servers, there are many softwares which are already up and running. Now, when you're bringing in a new piece, this machine learning code, you're you are basically putting it here. So you need to understand what softwares it has to work with so that the functionality does not break. How do you integrate it, right? So integration with respect to other software solutions that are already available. That is one thing we need to look at. And we also have to talk about the hardware on which the solution is getting deployed, right? This part. Because again, uh, it, it depends on what kind of solution we have developed here, what kind of data it is working on, and what is the kind of um, usage, right? Uh, this ML model will see. And we'll also have to uh, project the usage, right? We have to forecast the demand for this particular functionality. <clears throat> and based on that, we have to design the integration, design the hardware so that there is scalability. So all these aspects have to be considered when we are planning for deployment. 
So this is the logic that we are going to learn as part of this particular course.